I have done this before in my YouTube channel and I said clearly that I don't see the possibilities of President Uhuru Kenyatta handing over power to William Samuel Ruto. Last week we saw a team of CSS, President Uhuru Kenyatta put aside that they are going to conduct the exercises till the winner emerges. And if you keenly look at those CS, those are the people who are not supporting William Samuel Ruto, and those are the guys William Samuel Ruto usually keeps on attacking. In case you're here for the first time and you've not subscribed to my YouTube channel, kindly take a second or two. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, put on the notification bell so that every time I upload a new video, YouTube will automatically notify you. And for the returning subscribers, thank you very much for always supporting my content. And I will never get tired of thanking you guys. So again, the best thing you can do after watching my videos, just drop a comment, like the video so that YouTube will recommend it to other people. Waswahili wanasemanga kwamba when two bulls are fighting nyasi ndio umia President Uhuru Kenyatta and his deputy president William Samuel Ruto they have been fighting all over a long period of time yesterday and today again president Uhuru Kenyatta has come out Na akasema kwamba I'll never keep quiet while you guys are attacking me. To make matter worse today, he has said, I'll not go home alone, we'll go home with you. In my previous videos I did, I said that President Uhuru Kenyatta will not sit down and wait Raila Molodinga to come in alone. Now it's a combined effort between President Uhuru Kenyatta and Martha Karua to ensure that William Samuel Ruto has gone home and they have given Raila Molodinga votes from Mount Kenya. There's an opinion poll conducted last week that was true today whereby Raila Molodinga right now is ahead of William Samuel Ruto in central Kenya. That's amazing. You know very well that since William Samuel Ruto started campaigning in this country, he has been leading in Mount Kenya central parts. Now that Raila Molodinga unfailed Mother Karua, it's the first time Raila Molodinga has emerged the winner through that opinion poll that was conducted. What does that deal us politically? You know very well that Kikuyu people are not people you can easily win and play with their thoughts. These are the people who can look at you, analyze you, and decide if they are going to vote for you or not. Kikuyu have been saying that they will vote for William Samuel Ruto all for a long period of time. But right now, as things stand, the game is really changing every day. The region right now is singing Raira Molodinga and William Samuel Ruto. But who is going to be the winner? But according to the situations on the ground and how William Samuel Ruto started campaigning long time ago, I can say Raila Molodinga at moment is ahead of William Samuel Ruto because this is a man who has been fearing to go Mount Kenya and campaign. 
But right now, he has the courage of talking with people from Mount Kenya and they are listening to him. The campaigns of Kenya Kwanza in the region, they have been on a high level. You know very well that when they started the campaigns, they had a lot of money. They had put all the resources in their campaigns materials. That's why they gained name in Mount Kenya. But right now, the resources are really being exhausted by the common mona inch. Because if you start giving out money, at the end of the day, you will miss that money to give people so that they can vote for you. And if you look at the campaigns of Kenya Kwanza, it looks like William Samuel Ruto is digging deep to the pocket so that he can get a lot of money, funds, so that he can sustain his campaigns. How is compare William Ruto and Raila Molo Dinga? Raila Molo Dinga has a lot of people who are supporting him compared to William Samuel Ruto. That's why the narrative hustlers is there to demean Raila Molo Dinga. But Raila Moro Dinga kuna wale watu wakupwa hii Kenya who are doing businesses, they are supporting him. That's why his campaigns are always successive right now. And now the question is, do you think Uhuru Kenyatta is going to hand over power to William Samuel Ruto? Actually, according to me, I don't see if that one is going to happen. Yes, of course, we are in Kenya and not in Uganda, but ile fita tumeona kati ya president na, na debut wake imetuonyesha kwamba these people are not going to hand over power to one another. And if the president won't hand over power to William Samuel Ruto and he wins what is going to happen. You know this is Kenya. So many years we've been voting but the outcome or the one who wins is not for the people but the one who is given power is given power by the system and that's the Kenya we are and it will never change. Of course, we can see that Chepkati is in the side of William Samuel Ruto, not Raila Morodinga, but who knows if it's a game they are playing so that we can see that Chepkati is in the side of William Samuel Ruto. And if he fails and Raila Morodinga wins, Kenyans will accept that Chepkati tried, but it, it was unable to do what they planned for. We don't know if it's a game they're playing against us Kenyans, but the reality is Mount Kenya politics is changing. Again, and I said, Uhuru Kenyatta will campaign for Raila Moro Dinga towards the end of the days. Right now you can see how Uhuru Kenyatta is moving Mount Kenya. He has started launching projects that are going to be completed by Raila Morodinga. And there are some hospitals in Mount Kenya we are expecting him to give materials and equipments in those hospitals. Another thing is that this week we are heading is going to conduct meetings from leaders, leaders from Mount Kenya, politicians, and so many people. Who are they? who is going to attend those meetings. The same leaders we have been seeing coming with William Samuel Ruto are going to attend in those meetings. Now another question is, do you think those people who have been supporting William Samuel Ruto from Mount Kenya, they have been eating or they have been conning him? Let me see answers in the comment section so that we can prepare our next discussion. Bye.